Hi guys, your host here, Lee at Lee's Gaming Corner, with an episode of a trophy roundup with an additional game review at the same time. And the game we are actually playing is the Spectrum Retreat. So, as we go through the video, it will probably explain the reason why I'm decided to do a trophy roundup and a game review at the same time, as it is quite it will make sense over time the reason why I've chose to do the game review and the trophy roundup at the same time so without further ado don't forget to leave a like comment subscribe push the bell notification and miss a video and without further ado let's get into this um, video starting off with a little game review so basically the concept of the game is you play a a gentleman that's stuck in a hotel sort of thing, it's a retreat kind of thing and your basic view is to wake up it basically you've got five um, five levels and as we are now here, so we're in a puzzle at the moment and each level it's a puzzle section like this. But you start, you wake up, yeah, you get a knock at the door, you go and have your breakfast, then you start your puzzles. Once you've done that, you go back to bed, you wake up, and each time you do a puzzle, there's five in total, you wake, you go, you wake, you just go back to bed, you wake up to start the next section. That is basically how it is. Me personally, unless you're a trophy collector, I'd recommend only playing it for that reason. To to be fair, I found it after a while it got a bit repetitive and uh, boring to be honest. And basically just end up be playing it just for the trophies. And the downside about it, there's actually no platinum. But to be fair, I could probably see why there is no plan for it <coughs> to be fair personally as well I got this off of the um, PlayStation now personally wouldn't have paid the money for it myself so basically it to me is just a got it for the trophies that's all I've done I wouldn't really um, play it other than that things I've got little sort of thing I don't like my trophy list to be em or trophies collected in the game to be half collected unless there's a reason for it but other than that I personally wouldn't recommend it unless you just want the trophies for it and only good thing about it at the moment, to be fair, it's downloadable from the PlayStation now. So technically, yes, you've paid for it, but you've paid for, paid for the subscription to PlayStation, not the creators of this game. So that's all I can really say about the um, game review. I know it's a bit different than before. I know we do give good hype up with games once I've enjoyed it, but to be fair I really didn't enjoy it at all so I'm going to leave it there for this for the review side of this um, episode and I'm going to move on to the trophies that I have collected in total so now we've come on to the trophies that I've collected there is actually 15, 15 in total there is not many, um, there's, sorry, no, not many. There is no platinum, as I said in review. It's just 15 trophies I've got through entering codes, getting through the puzzles, and 
collecting all the miscellaneous trophies. There's no collectibles as such. Well, I say such as one, you've got to read the end book to get a trophy for that. But I won't give it too much to give the end in the way. And one thing I did actually forget to mention in the review, but it does sort of fit in well in with the um, trophy section here, is for a boring game you've got to play it twice. I'm afraid there's no do dallying around it. But I'll leave that for your for your discretion if you're gonna play it. Personally me, I wouldn't. Unless you just go for the trophies, that's what you play for. That's what you go and get for. To stick with the trophies. <coughs> get it done and then never touch it again. That's my plan. I've only just finished the game. Got the trophies for this review and trophy collections. And I've originally done it for just to so I can work on Heavy Rain's trophy list. Just so I've got something to show on my channel without making you lovely people wait. So, what we're going to do now is I'm going to go f show you all the trophies I've got so far, and then I'll be back right after that to end the episode. So, I'll see you after that section has gone through. So, until then, see you on the other side. So that's all the trophies I've actually managed to collect, all 15 of them in this episode. Just to do my final thoughts on my game review, I give it a 1 out of 10. A bit harsh, but in my opinion, I didn't enjoy it. It just came to the point of just get the trophies, go. So, other than that, I'm going to leave it there for this episode. I do hope you've enjoyed. Let me know in the comments down below if you prefer the reviews to be and the trophy run up to and done like this or kept separate. <coughs> but for the moment, I'll keep it separate until I found out from you guys. Until the, till the next episode, take it easy and I'll see you later. Bye!